hello guys how are you doing today so now we are going to learn how to create a custom list view and in it we will going to have the custom images with the custom text as well so for this I have taken a empty activity project and I am going to take a layout file and I am going to give it a name as custom view activity here I am going to set up my custom view I will set up one row and all these uh, data would be shown in my list view so I am going to take one image view I am going to drag it here I am going to give it ID as custom image view and I'll drag it like this I need to change my linear layout vertical to horizontal so that I can place the text along with the image now I'm going to take a text view I'm going to place it here give it ideas custom text view then I'm going to change its size I'm going to set it to 18 dp and I'm going to give it a margin from top and it's done so now we are going to go to our drawable folder and here I have to keep some images so that they can be shown in my each row so I'm going to copy some images for my desktop and I'm going to place them here and here they are in my main activity I am going to go and create two arrays one would be of string type I am going to give it a name as animals and other I would take an integer array and I'll place my drawable images in it I'm going to give it a name as images and I'm going to give the path of my drawable images folder here uh, one thing you need to remember you have to place the both the arrays in same sequence like if I have used cat here I have to place cat images image here so that it can show the same image in the same row
now it's done both my arrays are here now I'm going to take a custom class here custom adapter and I'm going to extend it from base adapter so it would be taking the four methods first would be get count here we will have to pass an integer and I will pass images my array name and dot length this would give the length of my images array these two I have to leave it like this only and in get view I will set up the view here I have to take one inflator I will take this convert view from the view class and I will set up my inflator to this this is my class name custom view activity which I have used here and now I am going to give it a null and then I am going to set my two components that I have taken in my custom view activity class one was text view and I am going to give it a name as row text and set up this to text view with convert view dot find view by id and I would set up it to my custom text view the same id as I have given in my custom view activity file and the other component I have taken was the image view then I'm going to set it to image view convert view dot find view by id r dot id dot my custom image view this is the id that I have given there and now I'm going to set up my text with the dot set text function and I am going to set it to the value so I want here animals name and now row image and here I will use set image resource and images variable array sorry and position and I have to return convert view and this is done I am going to take a custom adapter here I am going to give it a name as custom adapter then I am going to go and <coughs> set up my list this is our list view so I am going to define it here list view variable and I am going to set it up to the ID that I have taken in my activity main file
and then I'm going to set the adapter. So it's done. Now let's run it. This is the list view here. It's showing up all my images with the text. And this is it. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment and do subscribe to see my next video in that we are going to see that how we can fetch this data from a database thank you so much